Hi guys. Um, so there was a change of plans today. Um, we're supposed to do Minecraft today, but uh, the server needs updating. But also, um, I received Digimon Survive last night, which I'd been wanting to play. Um, and I'm super excited about it, and so I thought it would be fun to play a bit of it on stream. Probably play the whole game. We'll see. Um, but yeah, I, I was so excited about this game. Because Digimon is like... Is like my life. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I grew up with Digimon. It was, it was the best. I watched Adventure on TV, I watched the um, second Adventure on TV, I watched Tamers on TV, I watched some Frontier on TV. Um, like The first four seasons, I watched at least some episodes, and I loved them all, and um, after I did watch the fifth season online in the original Japanese, and that was really great, and I haven't really watched any other series past that, to be honest, but Digimon has always been like really, really big for me and it's... I love it so much. So we're going to play this today instead of Minecraft because I just really want to play it. So uh, let's, let's get in here. I don't... I haven't actually played any of this yet. It's completely new. I haven't watched anyone's gameplay or anything. <laughs> Oh, this is exciting. Why? Oh, oh is it? Oh, I should have checked if there's an English. It's okay. It's okay. I can read it for you guys. I'm scared. Don't worry. We're okay. Come on. Over here. I'll check after this if there's English, if I can get to the settings. To make it easier for you guys. Oh no, they made it over here already! Get away from there! Oh, is that a random one? It looks like a random one. I won't let you lay a hand on them! You guys! <sighs> Tip opening the pause menu. You can open the pause menu during the story or on the map screen. Oh. Okay. okay. Uh, well, it's time to learn the some of the basics of battle. In battle, the order in which units, monsters, act is determined by their speed. Let's start with movement. Press Z to choose the move command. Okay. Move. The area displayed on the grid represents the range of your character's movement. Okay. You can rotate the camera using Q, E, or adjust the zoom with 1 to 3. Oh, okay. So there's the zoom. Uh, this is fine. Um... You can rotate the camera using Q and E. Okay, that's that's cool. I like that. It's also important to switch over to the camera to get full grasp of your situation. Now move to the blinking square on the grid. Uh, and then move with, <laughs> with was Okay. Uh, move your cursor to the blinking square on the grid and press Z. Just like that. Press Z. Now prepare an attack. Press Z to choose the attack command. Yep. Okay. Here you can see information on the skills you can use. Okay. This includes the skills effect, SP cost, range, and area. The skills range is the distance it can reach, while its area refers to the size of its effect. Passive skills are special abilities that are always on. Pay attention to how each one works. Okay, I'm making sure I comprehend this. Okay. First, let's see what happens with an ordinary attack. Attacking does not cost SP. Okay. Choose attack from the skill list and press Z to confirm. Okay, attack. And attack the 
swirling thing. Elemental affinities, critical hit percent, and more are also shown to pay special attention. Okay. Counterattack percent is particularly important. This is the chance an enemy will encounter your attack. Counter your attack. Okay, so the stuff at the top there. I get it, I get it. Put the cursor on enemy using was and press Z. Nah. Wow! Punch in the face. Choose in turn to finish your turn. At the end of your turn, you can face in a direction with Wazd. Okay. You can take more damage if attacked from the side or from behind, so choose this carefully. Okay. Uh, use Wazd to face in direction and then Z. Okay. So we... Okay, so it's not just Wazd. I can use the arrow keys, so that's nice. <clears throat> It's important to check up on other units in battle. Switch to the free cursor to get more info. Press X or X <laughs> to switch the cursor. Ah, uh, I guess it's I guess it's X. You can move the free cursor anywhere on screen. Try putting it over an enemy. Okay. Hover the cursor over a unit to see its info displayed on the upper right. Okay. View more detailed information by pressing V in this state. V. Okay. That's odd. For some reason you can't see information for this enemy. There's nothing more to learn here. Press X to stop showing this information. Okay. I don't know. It looks kind of cool. I haven't seen that one before. <laughs> that didn't reveal anything useful. Switch back to the regular cursor and just go all out. Press X or X to switch back from the cursor. I'm assuming it's t multiple buttons because this is supposed to be played on controller. Not not keyboard and so there's two buttons on the controller this is no ordinary foe aim for extra damage by attacking it from behind move to the blinking square behind the enemy okay let's move we want to go here use a skill for big damage each skill move has its own sp cost choose the attack command like before then select blue blaster from the skill list attack and we want blue blaster Right here. You dealt extra damage by performing a rare attack. Flank attacks also do more damage. It doesn't seem to have taken much damage. Is this enemy too powerful to defeat? Okay. End turn. Uh, yeah, you're, you're good at the way you're facing. Don't worry about it. <clears throat> oh. 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 <laughs> Ugh, why I oughta? <laughs> no! I won't let you harm these children any more than you already have. If we can just get to that place. I'm okay. Go ahead for that light. Run, Haru. Get out of here. No way. I'm not leaving you behind. What are you doing? Go on, hurry. It's no good. I can't hold them back anymore. Look out! What the? It's sucking me in! Ah, if anything happened to you, I'd... You have to get back safe on your own, somehow. I gotta save her, but I... I can't! Okay. Wait for me. I'll rescue Miyuki. No matter what.
morning. You get any sleep last night? How about that quake this morning? Sure worked me up. Oh, that's so cool. What are these runes we're going to again? Hold on, I have a map in here somewhere. <laughs> Good morning. Minoru, don't scare me like that. <laughs> yeah, my bad. <laughs> Off to an early start, huh? Time to get up. Come on. Your food's gonna get cold. <laughs> oh no, she went by herself again. I can already tell by her design she's gonna be a favorite of mine. <laughs> like, she looks so cute. It's snowing? Okay, there. Two, one. Hey, move it. Sorry. Wow, you're such a charmer. No wonder all the girls love you. Oh, shut up. What brings us to the news? At roughly 5 o'clock this morning, a magnitude 3 earthquake. Wait, isn't that here? It caused a landslide, a part of the in region, and police and fire departments urge caution. Oh. Ooh. Where am I? Oh. Look at all those eyes! Due to the risk of further seismic activity, everyone in, in the Canova... Oh my god, this is crazy. It is really safe for us to go on this trip. All right, everyone, it's time for us to head out. Make sure you listen to your group leaders. Remember, this isn't a vacation. Make sure you stick to the schedule. This sucks. Spooky. Takuma? Ah, sorry. Just go distracted. I guess. That flashed way too quick. So that's not ominous at all. <laughs> oh, so exciting. So, this is camp, huh? Ooh. I say camp, but we're holed up in an abandoned school in the mountains here. Leave it to us to spend our school break going to another school. Not that the school is anything like the one we usually go to. Sup, Takuma? Today we're checking out that crusty old landmark. Sounds lame. Wait, they said something about pause menu, but I don't know the button to get to the pause menu. <laughs> Come on, don't say that, Minoru. Not like I disagree, but still. Hey, you two, don't talk like that. I told you we weren't here for fun and games. Yeah, yeah, so sorry, your highness. Ugh. Again with that kind of talk. That knucklehead over here is Minoru. And the girl lecturing him is Aoi. A Aoi? Yeah. I didn't talk to her much at school. Aoi's cool. She came here from a different school. We got to know each other more here at camp. And that's mostly thanks to Minato. The three of us ended up doing our extracurricular activities together. To play the game, you'll occasionally be asked to make choices. You'll have two to four options to choose from. Use the arrow keys to select a response or action, and then Z. Okay. Your decisions will affect your affinity with different characters and influence the story. That's just why I'm extra excited about this game. Like, it's it's all, all story-based. Choices matter. Apparently, people might die. Hopefully not. 
uh, your affinity with other characters influences the, the battle backup they give during combat, with differing results if you treat everyone equally as opposed to focusing on one person. You can check your affinities from the main menu, so don't forget to keep an eye on them. Uh, I guess, I guess I'll ask Oe about our plan? Uh, also, uh, nine is menu. Oh, cool. That's profile. Where is settings? Okay. I don't know if there is actually an English option for you guys. So I might just have to continue to read subtitles <laughs> to help people out. Because, yeah. <laughs> Though I might just... Turn the music down just a tad because I feel like it might have been a little bit loud. Uh, we're going to read that. Yep, yep, yep. Yes, apply settings, please. <clears throat> and then X to leave. Okay. <clears throat> so, let's see. Let's. Let's ask Oe about our plan. Oe-san, what do you think about this course? What's the name of the Sakura Namiki? What's today's route, Oe? We're starting at the Cherry Blossom Trees, right? Today we're going here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Today we're going here and then I think we're over here. And do you know why, Minato? Something about local legends or religion, right? They say there's some weird stuff. Not that matters to me, I'm just here for fun in the sun. Takuma-kun <laughs> Ah, you're the only one I can rely on, Takuma. Keep an eye on him, would you? Yeah. I'm not Minoru's babysitter over here. Ah, <laughs> uh, whoa! Huh? What is it? Looks like Minoru's not no. <sighs> Looks like Minoru's noticed something on his phone. Check it out, there's another story about a rock slide. That's several days in a row now. I hope it doesn't mean an earthquake's coming. Not just that, but look here, isn't this close to where we're supposed to go today? Oh, hi! Welcome, I'm playing... Playing Digimon <laughs> because Digimon. <laughs> uh, wait, really? I wonder if our plans for the day are still on. You can feel the tension in the air around here. Someone must have shared the news. Alright, everyone, calm down. Everything's going to be just fine. All the teachers have clear instructions for dealing with any emergency. Shuji is in Illuminus? I do not know that word. Illuminus? I am looking up this word because I have not read that before. At least not to my knowledge and knowing what it meant. A former pupil or student, especially a male one of a particular school. Okay, so he used to go to a school. Okay. Shuji is an illum illuminous of Aoi's school, so he came to help chaperone. The teachers and chaperones are ensuring our safety, so there is nothing to worry about. Fear not, fellow students. Our destination is this historic landmark. Off we go! Ah, 
There he goes, at it again, that Shuji is too straight-laced for his own good. Is there any way to talk about someone two years older than you? Right you are, my little Aoi. And do I have to remind you, Momonaru, that I'm actually in a grade above yours? <laughs> I mean, shouldn't you act like it then or something? Should be more like and more of a nag, like I told you to knock that off. <laughs> Does that sound like something I would say? Let's go before we're left behind, Takuma. Yeah, come on, Takuma, let's hit it. Okay. On with the story. <laughs> And it's doing that anyway. Oh wow, the cherry blossoms are in full bloom. Everyone stops on the way to the landmark to take in the flowers. Man, is this spring or is this spring, am I right? Right, maybe the abundance of nature here brings out the beauty of these blossoms. Oh, oh, I gotta pick a... Oh, okay. Let me just... Okay, I'm glad we came here. Can we take a breather? We should go on ahead. Uh, I, I, I'm glad we came here. Moral changed. Ah. I'm glad we came on this camp. Makes me look forward to this uh, to, to the historic landmark ahead. Indeed, I find myself brimming with a sort of excitement. <laughs> if you put that in, put it that way, it sounds like we've got some fun ahead of us. Oh, looks like Saki and Ryo beat us to the punch. They did go on ahead of us after all. Ah, Saki and Ryo. The guy shooting daggers at everyone is Ryo, an older kid from another school. The girl who's all smiles there is Saki. Her looks are famous in the grade below ours. They must be here to enjoy the cherry blossoms too. <laughs> then again, I could be wrong in Ryo's case. Wow, look how beautiful it is. The flowers are so pretty. <laughs> what kind of person gets all grumpy in front of a bunch of blooming cherry blossoms? But man, talk about a waste. Gorgeous weather and we're doing extracurricular nonsense. What does one have to do with the other? <laughs> I thought as much. We're not in any real rush. Might as well look around here some more. Oh, look around? As you play the game, you'll be presented with choices of where to go or who to talk to. Use the mouse to select target. Try targeting one of the students walking along the tree-lined path in the distance. Okay. Okay, I can actually use my mouse for this. Nice. You can also switch between targets using Q and E. Try switching targets while you have one selected. Okay. Interesting. Once you've selected a target, press Z to move to the next step. Who you talk to and in what order may advance the story. You can target more than just characters, so keep an eye out for unexpected discoveries. Targets that lead to an important story conversation will be marked with an exclamation mark. 
So keep that in mind when deciding what you want to do next. Okay. Okay, let's talk to the campus first, I guess. Let's go to the campus. Ugh, I'm so tired. This camp is weak. Yeah, total weak source. Ah, well, at least we get a few bars out here. We can kill a little time with that. For real? I can't even get a signal in the school building. Haha, <laughs> man, what a hunk of junk you're lugging around. Okay. <laughs> Cherry trees. Cherry trees lining the path are all in full bloom with gorgeous petals fluttering down. I'd love to just sit here and gaze at them for a while. Same, man. Same. Ah, uh, the stream. If I listen closely, I can hear the sound of a babbling brook. You'd never hear something like that in the city. It's sort of comforting. I guess now I have to pick who to talk to. Hmm, should I pick to... pick... Aoi? Minoru? Yeah, I can't talk to Rio, so I'll talk to these two first. Uh, who should we talk to first? Aoi or Minoru? Uh, let's talk to Aoi first. <laughs> the flowers are certainly beautiful in full bloom. Yeah, that and the weather makes you want to sit down and take a load off for a while. <laughs> now that won't do. We have to stick to our designated course. Aye aye, ma'am. Okay, let's talk to Minato now. Hey, Takuma, did you know that the leaves of cherry blossoms are poisonous? That's why you never see any weeds growing underneath them. Huh, is that right? Wait, don't people eat those sometimes? Well, sure, they're fine if you pickle them first. Huh, you sure know some weird things, man. Cool. Uh, and then let's talk to Saki. Jeez, what crawled up your backside and died? Search me. Let me guess, Shuji and the teachers gave you flack for your cheerful disposition. You do know what you're talking about. Sure, sure, whatever you say. Come on, it's time to go. <laughs> Alright, already. Okay, and then we can talk to him. Cool. And anyway, how long do you plan on following me around? What do you expect? Who knows what you'll do if I take my eyes off of you, Ryu? Ryo? Not Ryu. So you're my supervisor now? Clearly you're not the type to be left to your own devices. Oh, just shut up. And off he goes. Now is that any way to talk to a cute girl like me? And off she goes. Saki's headed for the landmark, chasing Ryo as Zihi continues belly aching. Uh, okay. Okay, and now I can talk to these guys again. Uh. Do we go and talk to the girl or talk to the boy? Hmm. It could be important which way we talk. I don't know. I've talked to her, like, first a couple times. Let's let's talk to Monado this time. <laughs> Those who get along way better than I figured they would. More like Saki can get along with anyone. That Rio is a real pain, too. She must be kind of, some kind of saint. Now, is there any way to speak about him? All of us need to work together. I never heard anything come out of his mouth that wasn't a complaint about something. I can kind of relate, to be honest. It's like... Looking at how I used to be, kind of embarrassing. You sure he's older? Your past self? Is that something a middle schooler is supposed to say? Then again, I suppose an adolescent boy would say such things. Saki's the exact opposite. The way she comes at you head on makes her seem more grown up. We only just met here at camp, but she acted like we were all best buds from square one. I think you resemble her in that regard, Minato. Yeah, he's the, uh, the one who broke the ice with us after all. Indeed, head on, as you would say. Huh? Jeez, guys, knock it off with the compliments. My ego can only take so much. That wasn't a compliment. <laughs> uh, brutal. 
ma'am, is it? Finally, some good manners. Oh, uh, sure. That's what I was going for. And I wish she, uh, she'd back off a bit, you know? Read the room a little, so to speak. I suppose it depends on how you look at it. She can be outspoken at times, to be sure. But she's also cheerful, cute, and quite ami amicable. The sort of honesty you sense from her, I quite like it. Whoa, where did all that come from? She just seems a bit radiant, don't you think? I, I see. Still, she goes a bit overboard. A big sister like me has to look out for her. <laughs> Would you look at those flowers? How wonderful. Hey, did you know, Aoi? They say there's a dead body under every cherry blossom tree. I don't want to hear about that right now. I'd rather we head toward the historic landmark if we could. Everyone went this way. Looks pretty rocky up that path, huh? What a pain. It was normal conversation on a normal day with friends. Well, normal other than the camping part. At least that's what I thought. Dun dun dun! Let me just move my mouse down there, since it's not in the way. We cleared the tree lined path, and when we headed up the trail. <clears throat> Huh? Look at that. Huh? Why is there a police car here? Oh. oh no, it looks like the road is blocked off from here. You're right, there's a lot of tape that says keep out. Hmm, maybe it's related to the rock slide Minoru was talking about. Oh man. Oh man, did I call it or did I call it? Just find my ass, right, Takuma? Oh dear, this poses a problem. There's only one path to the landmark through here. That landmark. What was its deal again? This is why I told you to review the site of the ritual related to the kimono and kimono gami. Kimono gami. Those kimono gami things don't really ring a bell. You mean the beast gods? Yeah, kimono means animal and or something like that and yami can mean god so yeah he's god nothing we can do about it our only option is to head back for now we've come all this way might as well get the lowdown on what went down here let's see what people gathered in front of the police car have to say oh we get to select talking to people again Maybe I should ask the police officer what's going on here. Okay, let's see. Okay, so he's going to increase things. Let's go from left to right. Or at least, let's... Yeah, except for, like, the people that are we friends with. Wheels are so faded, I can't make out what the sign is supposed to say. It must be really old. Noted. What are these campers saying? Hold up, what? You're saying there was an accident? Also, it's interesting that it calls her braided girl. But those pigtails are not in braids. They're just... pigtails. <laughs> Dang, man. I ain't never seen something like this before. What do you think? Should we just bust on in there, grab a video for some views? 
<laughs> Whoa, hold up, man. They'll get pissed at us, for sure. What's his face? Shuji said he'd go and ask the teachers about it, you know? Okay. Oh, dearie me, I can't tend to my fields if I can't get through. Landslide? How frightful. Nothing but strange things happen around these parts. You got that right. This keeps up all the old timers are gonna blame it on monsters. Now, now, don't say such things in front of the children. Okay. Uh, vertical sign. The closed road sign set up here by the police doesn't offer any details. The people around here say that a landslide happened up the road. Okay, uh, and then I can listen to the grey-haired lady. <laughs> oh, hi. Hey now, don't let them young'uns get too close now. They'll be cursed. Cursed? Say what? You feeling okay, Granny? We ain't buying that kind of crap, you feel me? <laughs> Believe it or not, the Kimonogami curse will find you. Kids should stay away. Sure. <laughs> You gotta be kidding me. Ain't no one believing that hocus pocus these days. Haha, <laughs> man, I love it out here in the sticks. These old farts know how to crack a joke. Okay. Uh, please come. Seeing it with my own eyes, it's more impressive than I'd imagined. Pretty cool. It's not like I want to become a cop, but... I'd like to try riding in one sometime. Ooh, now, Aoi... Oh, no, we can do police tape, and then we have to pick between the two. Tape says keep out. Who knows what's going on past here? Feels kind of surreal to me. Maybe I've watched too many crime shows. Okay. Aoi Uminato. Uh... Let's talk to Aoi so many people. What could have happened? What? Think there was an accident or something? Let's ask around. Okay. They had nothing really to add. Let's talk to the police officer. <laughs> Excuse me, did something happen here? There was a landslide up ahead around dawn, so the road's been sealed off. Oh, that must be the one we read about online earlier. Okay. So now I get to pick between them. Oh no. Uh let's pick Aoi again. Because why not? Oh dear, we can't proceed with things like this. Yeesh, so much for exploring the great outdoors. Guess camp was cancelled. I don't know about all that. Still, perhaps we should turn back for now. Okay. Landslide for really reals? Man, think the guys that went ahead are okay? No childish jibes? I suppose you wouldn't be so callous as to joke at a time like this. Of course, even I know when to watch my mouth. Sometimes, maybe. So I'm guessing the story would have been completely different if I had chosen to go ahead instead of waiting. And just chilling out with the cherry blossoms. The area ahead is off limits. Seems we can't get through here. What's the plan? Should we head back for now? No way! Don't talk out of your ass or you'll regret it. Huh? I can hear someone kicking up a fuss. Yeah, who is it? Hey look, that Ryo and Saki are over there. Ah, <laughs> it's the cute girl! I love it, does I look at her little slams? <laughs> I love it. I knew they went ahead. I guess they took the long way around. More importantly, who's that girl, I wonder? Excuse. <laughs> ah. <laughs> uh. Okay, you listening? These rock slides are retribution from the Kimono... Kimonogami. I'm... Suck at pronouncing things. Ret 
retribution in this day and age? Give me a break. Yes, when disrespectful outsiders cause trouble on the mountain, they get mad. This holy mountain is the Kimonorium, a sacred shrine to the Kimonogami. This is no place for someone to just wander around! <laughs> oh, the tone of voice. The hexakimonarium. <laughs> I, I bet it's some weird rock or bear carving. They worship that stuff in the boonies. <laughs> Chill out, Ryo. She's just a kid. You don't have to get so nasty with her. Nasty? I was just... <laughs> the boonies, you say? How rude. This is a site of a glorious shrine. Not some new imitation, but a historic, legendary shrine known only to locals. A shrine? You mean like the ones it's supposed to have ancient gods? I've read about those before. Gods of the harvest or fertility, things like that. Nah, this is different. These are ancient beast gods, known only to the locals. I've known all about these gods ever since I came here. Sounds like a fairy tale to me. It isn't, they're real! What's your name, kid? It's Mew. What's your name? I'm Saki, and this guy with the tear is Ryo. So, Mew, do I do you think you could take us to this hidden shrine you're talking about? Take you. Um, I guess so. Curious, huh? You don't really believe in this stuff, do you? I'm telling you, it's real! Why not? Our trip's been cancelled, it's not like we don't have the time. All we have in waiting for us back at camp is some busy work, right? You hate that stuff. Are you seriously telling me you're not even a little bit in tiny bit interested in all this? I still say this is stupid. It is not stupid! Yeah, yeah, yeah whatever you say, kid. It's not kid, it's Mew! I'll lead the way, Mew. I'm not gonna be happy if you're messing with us, got it? I guess they're off to get some extra credit somewhere. That's Saki for you. Extra credit, more like, let's just wander off. <laughs> Can we just grab this? Do that, let it cool a bit, and then grab it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Something tells me they're not up to anything so commendable. They don't even know what kind of temple it is, do they? Entry may be prohibited. You've never heard of it, are we? 
Hmm, I don't see anything like it on the map. I mean, she did say only locals know. Could there really be a hidden shrine, or is it just some kid's imagination? What do you think, Takuma? Oh, we're gonna follow them. <laughs> uh, let them have fun. We have to stop them. Sounds fun. Sounds fun to me. Let's go. <laughs> Sounds like a good time. Let's follow them. <laughs> Affinity with Minato with up. Okay. Yeah, now that's what I'm talking about. Hey, you guys! <laughs> oh, great. Just what we needed. <laughs> the Shrine of the Kimono Ugami? Sounds fun. Can we go with you? Sure, the more the merrier. Thanks, nice to meet you. You too. Sounds like we had a couple of eavesdroppers. Won't you and your merry band of bozos go back to your school trip? Let's get a move on, you. Come on, don't be like that. Jeez, Rio, that attitude of yours needs some work. Sorry about that, you guys. Rio, you and Mew, wait up. There they go again. For now, we'd better wait here for someone to tell us where to go next. That will head back to the school. I thought I thought when we said sounds fun, we were gonna go with them. Why why are we now debating where we're going? I thought we were going with them to the shrine. I want to see the shrine. To admit it, that sounds like a pain. More importantly, we have no idea what might happen. We should chase after those three. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, let's follow them. Like, I thought that's what we were doing in the first place. Why are we debating this? <laughs> let's go. <laughs> My kind. Oh, I took the paper. And there's paper. Searing Saki, Ryo, and that little kid Mew, we ended up at a tunnel. Not a soul to be seen around us, and no other paths. Did they head through here? Look at uh, uh, this dark, creepy little murder tunnel. Tell me about it. Does it feel colder around here to you? It makes my skin crawl. Would you two refrain from such absurd talk? I bet one of those ghost hunter shows would get a kick out of this clip. Is refrain not in your vocabulary? Come on now, we must find those two. I mean, there's three of them. I don't, I don't see them here. Maybe we should forge on ahead? Oi, you there! Oh, looks like we've got a guest. Hey, Shuji! <laughs> Shuji, is that you? Oh, that's right. Oh, 
You can't just run off on your own. We have enough trouble with the landslide as it is. <laughs> Excuse me, you bluster ship? <laughs> bluster ship. <laughs> Besides, we think Saki and Ryo went this way. Oh, four. <laughs> That guy has to learn to act his age already. I have his and Saki's names in the student phone book. I'll try giving them a call. I mean, but isn't like the signal out here pretty bad? Yeah, that's what I thought, buddy. He's been letting it ring for a while now. I guess Saki hasn't noticed yet. The fact that it is ringing, though, means that they do have enough bars. So what do you think those kimono gami deals the girl was talking about are like? Who knows, some kind of animals, I guess? Minoru, you didn't hear a single word of the lecture on today's landmark, did you? The gods taking the shapes of beasts, the legend of which it was passed down in this area. That kid said only the locals know them, so I bet this land has some unique creatures. Unique creatures. I don't know, I tried saying characters for some reason. Uh. <laughs> So they became gods and started handing out retribution like hotcakes? Give me a break. <clears throat> People used to attribute that unknown to the gods, giving offerings to prevent disaster. Most people don't come around here these days. I imagine only locals come to visit. That's the way the cookie crumbles. No good. It seems that neither Saki nor Ryo have a signal where they are. But, <clears throat> if they don't have signal, it doesn't ring. If it was ringing, they have signal. Huh, I guess it'd be weird if their phones worked in the middle of nowhere like this. And you're sure that they came this way? Well, yes, we're quite certain. They ain't around here, that's for sure. Maybe the shrine is up here? It isn't on our map, so we're not sure where to look. Alright, we'll have to track those two down and head back to the school ASAP. They're past this tunnel? Alright, let's go. I should talk with the others about what to do to search for Saki and the others. Hmm. Shuji, Aoi, look at the tunnel. Okay, let's look at the tunnel first. And then pick who we can talk to. Stark inside the tunnel. I can't see a thing. It looks pretty old. I'm a little scared to go inside. Okay, who to talk to? Hmm. Oh, no. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. I pressed the wrong button, but it's fine. I don't see any... I... Why is auto on? I didn't put auto on. Oh, jeez. Well, yes, but, uh... You're not afraid of the dark, are you, are we? J just a bit. Creeps me out a little bit. Hey, why are we talking about this? We have to bring Saki and the others back uh, right, uh, right away. I meant to press these buttons. Uh, let's talk to Minoru next. Then we'll talk to Shuji. Boy, just when I thought I was uh, gonna die of boredom, 
They're getting interesting. Things are getting interesting. Are you going to join the search? Who cares about that? This tunnel, a lost shrine? I smell adventure, don't you? Uh, I think I see what you mean. Right? Might as well look for some runes uh, while we look for those jokers. Ruins? I think the joke might be on you. Hey, Shuji. You know, you could have stopped them from going in the first place. I could have! But I thought it sounded fun. <laughs> uh, well, we kind of tried. They weren't in any mood to listen, so- We never tried, Takuma! Don't you lie! You're lying to Shuji's face right now. We're like, hey, that sounds like fun, can we come too? And then for some reason we lagged behind. Come on. Ah, I see. Um, well, nothing to be done about it. I'll help persuade them next time, so no worries. Come on, let's go bring back Ryo and Saki together. That being said, which way should we go? Huh? Hey, who's that coming this way? Hey, it's the guy. Excuse me. Like, Mew's person that she knows. Big brother? Cousin? Neighbor? Who knows? Excuse me, all of you are from that camp, right? There we go. Little sister. I live around here. I'm just looking for my little sister. Your sister? <clears throat> yes, she's a bit frail, but likes to go off on her own. My sister's... How do I put this? Like a tiny animal? Timid and needing protection. <laughs> uh, are we talking about the same girl? There was a kid hanging around here named Mew, but she doesn't fit the bill. Mew? Mew? Did you just say Mew? Uh, yeah, I sure did. Yes, we met a girl named Mew, maybe grade school age, wearing a hat with cat ears. Yeah, that's her. You've seen her? Say what? The girl we met had a few more screws loose than the girl you're describing. Hey, hey don't be rude, Minato. I'm just saying I didn't see any shrinking violet who needed saving is all. To be fair, he didn't say she needs saving, more like you want to protect her. That doesn't mean that you're saving her from stuff. <laughs> Who cares what you, you thought of her? Just tell me where did she go? Well, I'm sorry, but we're actually looking for her ourselves. We went to a shrine, uh, to go to a shrine with some of the other campers. We're just going to try and bring them back with us. I see, so she went off on her own. Thank you very much. After I told her, she's not allowed to go in there. My name is Kaito. If you want, we could go look for them together. Why not? We're all after the same thing. Plus, you know, we're the places, right? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> sure. I'll show you the way. I wasn't raised here, but I've lived here for a long time. I know where the shrine is. Come on, follow me. I'm Minoru. That's Takuma. And this here is Aoi. 
Kaito -kun. And I'm the lead of Shuji. Nice to meet you, Kaito. From the looks of him, I thought Kaito was an adult, but he's the same age as us. Well, it's me, I think it said. I'm relieved, though. It looks like we can count on him. We'll get there in no time. Huh? Hmm? Uh, say, guys, it's spring now, right? Does a bear poop in the woods? If it's not spring, then when is it? I just figured we're a little too far south for it to snow at the start of spring. What are you... <laughs> Music suddenly turns ominous. You're right, snow. Calling this unseasonal would be a bit of an understatement. Indeed. Snowed here last week too, I heard the weather gets all wonky around these parts. Oh, smells like the digital world. <laughs> Heard of similar stories in other places. Whoa, uh, some kind of blizzard has kicked up here, yeah? So cold. It's too dangerous to keep going. I'll go take a look, so why don't you all go back? <clears throat> Why don't we duck back into that tunnel? Who knows what happened before we made it back. Fair enough. It might not be indoors, but it's better than staying out here. <clears throat> That's true. Okay, let's retreat to the tunnel for now. Cool. Now we'll take a food break. Saki and the others came through here, huh? Hmm. It's getting colder and colder, I can pick. Is this still being used? The tunnel is cold, or always shaking? Hmm. I'll just think about it as I eat. <clears throat> hmm. I mean, is this being used? Kind of... Kind of feels redundant because it does look like an old abandoned tunnel. Like, why would I think it was being used in the first place? <laughs> <clears throat> So the question comes down to, do I say the tunnel is cold, or do I know it's always shaking? Hmm. I'm gonna say the tunnel is cold. Wrathfulness changed? Interesting. <clears throat> Jeez, it's cold in here. Do you have any mittens or something? Anything, Minoru? Why the heck would I have mittens in spring? I didn't see a cold snap like this coming. Yeah, that's true. I bet those three went ahead are really feeling it now. Imagine they just ran on in if Mew was with them. She's used to that place. This, she's used to the place. Oh, 
It's getting dark and the footing isn't getting... It isn't great here. Let's go, but watch your step. It's pitch black, I can hardly see in front of me. <clears throat> Still, isn't this like some kind of expedition? I'm kind of, I'm getting kind of pumped. Hey, there's no time to play around. It's not safe for us to keep going like this. Ah, but if we use the camera light. <clears throat> Okay. Nice. <laughs> I'll knock it off, Minoru. Did you just scream like that? Even I got spooked. Uh, my bad. I just saw this here, so... You guys didn't notice that before? Like, that's the first thing I noticed. This is a sacred rope? What would something like that be doing here? Hmm. Maybe this is where the kimono gami are enshrined or something? Now I think about it, you mentioned that you weren't allowed to enter here, right? <clears throat> yeah, the village believes in retribution. Kids are warned to stay out. Uh, what, what is this wind coming from the tunnel entrance? Oh, jeez. There must be a hell of a storm whipping up outside. You think those three are in trouble? We'd better hurry on to the shrine. Yes, uh, yes, you're right. Come on. There's no time to lose. Let's go. Huh? The snowfall is slowing down. What the? What happened to the blizzard? This tunnel isn't that long. What could be happening here? <laughs> Talk about lucky. It just up and stopped on us. Yeah, but wouldn't there be snow on the ground? It's more like it didn't snow at all on the side of the tunnel. Ooh, flowers. <clears throat> Look at these flowers, aren't they something else? The forest is a sea of red. I feel like I've seen them in our field guide, maybe? If memory serves, these are called red spider lilies. Right, that's what they are. But, but this isn't right, it's spring and... Yes, they bloom in autumn. What in the world is going on here? Hmm, has Aoi figured something out? Should we check out this area a little more before heading to the shrine. Yeah, let's check out the area. What a suspicious looking forest. I should look around or maybe talk with the others. Let's see what the options are. Okay, so we've got three options. Spider Lilies, Shuji, and Aoi. Okay, so let's talk to Shuji first. He doesn't have an exclamation mark. Abnormal weather occurs in this area. Maybe it was a localized snowstorm? First I've heard of something like that. That blizzard was no joke. Then there are the red spider lilies, which only bloom in the fall. I'm telling you, man, spring is in the air. 
Hmm. What the heck is this? Okay. Spider lilies or owie? I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at the spider lilies first. What's this? There's a bunch of stuff floating in the air. You think it's those whatchamacallits? Spores? I've never heard of red spider lilies doing something like this. These things aren't bad for us, are they? Flowers like these can be found anywhere. I mean, they look pretty normal. And they talk to Aoi. This area, I have a bad feeling about it. Something's not right. Not right how? Um, I'm sorry, I can't quite put it into words. Take the flowers. They should be pretty, but they give me the creeps more than anything. I mean, yeah, but that's also because uh, a lot of, like, media attributes them to, like, blood and stuff. So that's why I find them creepy. Come on, let's hustle. The snow should be on us soon. Let's get to the shrine. Yeah, he's right. Lead the way. <laughs> they don't seem to be anywhere around here. The shrine must be further in. The shrine must be just ahead. We should head toward it for now. This is... Oh. It's the shrine! Oh, where's Mew? And Saki. And Ryo. I remember all their names. It's okay. I kind of said people never come here, but it's breathtaking. It's also kind of eerie. How could anyone expect... Sorry. How could anyone expect visitors to come to a shrine all the way out here? They didn't. In fact, they made sure to warn anyone about getting too close. That's strange. I don't see the others anywhere. I could have sworn I saw someone just now. Now where could they be? We should all look around and see what we can find. Okay. Should I look around here? <clears throat> okay. Is, is that literally it? Is, is it just the old train? Yep. That's like the, the old train. Nothing. Nothing else. I I guess we're exploring the old train. <laughs> <laughs> The shrine, nothing looks out of place here. You taking pictures, bud. Check out this place. There are crazy patterns all over. Minoru is snapping tons of photos on his phone. Huh, didn't know he was into that. <laughs> I bet they've got some kind of some freaky demon statue stowed away in there or something. <clears throat> I know about that, but what if they worship here isn't normal, that's for sure. What's this? Some sort of animal? A bird? Wait, a reptile? Well, show me these patterns. I want to see. There are patterns of various animals all over, but I don't recognize any of them. Are they Digimon? Totally Digimon. Ooh, what's this? A lion? A dog? Wait, a lion dog? Man, I just eat this stuff up! <laughs> Damn it, Minoru! Now's not the time to be taking pictures! What? Man! Shuji's right. We have to look for Saki and the others. Still, this place is so weird, I'm not surprised Minoru wanted a few mementos. Hmm. 
time. Have this fun. Take more, take more over here, or enough photos. Uh, I'll just I'll just let him have his fun. <clears throat> Actually, we may need the pictures later. What do you mean? If, if we take the pics of the area, we might notice something we wouldn't have over, we would have overlooked otherwise. <clears throat> oh, I see. Well, well, if that's the reason, I guess it's okay. Come on already, we have to find them and fast. Right, sorry, okay, let's go. Wow, the shrine really does worship beasts. There are places like this all over Japan. Some worship octopuses or weird ass trees. <laughs> the ones that worship the loot stuff are the best. <laughs> but no, please. He totally goes to the penis festival every year. <laughs> uh, hey, watch that talk. There's a lady present. Naru, I wonder, is this the place passed down in the legends we're supposed to visit today? Legends? Who knows? As I said, I was told... Sorry. <laughs> As I said, I was told not to set foot in here. I don't know much about it. But the locals say people get spirited away up in here. I see. That's certainly frightening. Oh, well, that's a cry. What was that sound? I've never heard anything like it before. He never said before. Don't mind me. <laughs> Just trees cracking in the wind or something. Who cares? Let's go, let's go. Um, hey guys, don't stray too far, okay? <laughs> the blizzard might not be the only thing we have to worry about. Let's look for clues. Exploration! Okay. We doing something new? Oh, here's the world map. Okay. As you play the game, you'll need to travel to locations on your map to advance the story. You'll slowly gain access to more locations by progressing through the game. Spider Lily Forest unlocked. Oh. Shrine unlocked. Okay, um... Swi uh, switch over to the list view to see a location's information on the bottom right of the screen. Also pay attention to the icons displayed on the list. A uh, person means there's someone at that location. The character icon is displayed in the bottom right corner. Okay, I see that. Uh, an exclamation mark lets you know if you talk to the person who's there, it will advance the plot. Other icons will show you where to find an important clue or alert you to an enemy. Okay. So keep all of them in mind as you play through the game. Now, try selecting a location to advance in the story. Okay, so use the arrow keys to switch it to the list, then press Z to confirm. Okay, so we definitely don't want to do that first. We want to go to the shrine. We'll do the not important story stuff first. To play the game, you'll be presented with situations where you have to explore. In this mode, you'll need to talk to others or investigate the world to find clues to progress. The clues you need may not always be nearby. Open your map and try searching other areas too. You can always use the map to travel between areas while exploring. Open the map with the one button. Clues will be marked with an exclamation mark during exploration too, so keep an eye out for them. It looks like right now there aren't any clues in the area, try searching somewhere else. I should talk with Minoru and Tsuji about what to do next. 
Yeah, I want to I want to talk to people and investigate. Shrine gate. I haven't seen such an, a big impressive gate anywhere else. They say great gates. They say such gates connect the worlds of gods and men. What gods could there be here? Sorry, my brain is not reading properly. <laughs> but yeah, let's look at the old shrine. A shrine built in the middle of a spooky forest it really makes you want to stay away. Guess it's what you'd call solemn. Okay. And then we've got Shuji and Minoru talk to her. Let's talk to Shuji first since he's right here. <clears throat> Don't spread out too far, everyone. Stay where I can see you. Shuji's doing his best to keep us all together. Still, get back here, Minoru. Listen to what I say. Sir, yes, sir. I do apologize, your blustership. <laughs> blustership. <laughs> that's, that's great. What's up, Minoru? What are you doing over here? <clears throat> Minoru's lost in his in its historical photo op. Better not interfere. Okay. Let's go back to the map then. And we'll go to the spider lily forest. And let me just see. <clears throat> that photo just fell down, so I can't finish eating. <clears throat> Hey, there's Kaito. Has he found something? I found anything? Okay. We can... Okay, let's talk to Aoi first. <clears throat> You've been pale for a while now, Aoi. How are you holding up? Uh, well, if I'm being honest, it's taking all I've got to deal with this place. You shouldn't push yourself if you're scared, okay? Thank you, but our friends might be facing something even scarier, you know? Saki, Rio, where are you? Hey, let's talk to Kaito. Hey, Mew, where are you? Oh, Takuma. Have those guys found anything over there? Nothing yet. You found Mew? Nope. Jeez, where the hell is she? Saki and Rio are with her for sure. Here, I'll join the search. They'd be great help. Thanks. I mean, I thought we were searching anyway. Okay, we have talked to everyone here. <clears throat> Is there more clues back at the shrine? Let's go to the shrine. <clears throat> I should check in with the others. Okay. Who are we talking to? Uh, let's see if anyone has anything more interesting to say again. <clears throat> Damn it, Mew, where have you gone? Kaito's upset. It's understandable, his family is still missing. This is what I mean by yeah, everyone doing what they want. Saki and Ryo are no different. That's what causes trouble like this. We have rules for a reason, people. No one wander off on their own, got it? Okay, talk to Aoi. Saki, Ryo. Aoi's doing her best to score the area. I should leave her to it. Okay. <clears throat> What's up, Minato? Huh? What? What's in this picture? Yo, Takuma! You should take some pictures around here too. Me? But why? My phone's picking up some weird stuff. Might be broken. Let's check yours. You sure your finger isn't in the shot? It ain't my finger! Something's like all fuzzy in my pics. Go on, take some. Doesn't sound like he's messing around. Guess I'll take a few test shots. As you play the game, you will sometimes be able to find clues using the camera on your phone. A camera icon will appear on the top left of the screen when this is the case. You can take out your camera at any time while you're exploring. Access your camera with three. Your camera can sometimes reveal things that would otherwise be invisible. Try using it now. Uh, okay. <clears throat> can I... Oh, three. Three for the camera. Okay, use the mouse to move the camera. If you notice any distortion while using your camera, try focusing on it to investigate. Okay. Oh, yep, yeah, there's some distortion over there. And then click. <clears throat> oh, oh, I know that one. 
I can't remember its name right now, but I know that one. <clears throat> what the heck? Huh. Nothing's here, but the camera definitely picked up something. Hmm. What's this? What is it, Mono? Hey, you guys. There's a weird thingy over here. Weird thingy. Who knows what that could mean. Well, hey, don't just go off on your own. Ugh, fine. We'll go. We'll all go together. <laughs> what in the world? Look, it's the size of this thing. Look at the size of this thing? I don't know. <clears throat> Wow, are these runes? Hmm. These look pretty old. Say, any idea what this is? Not a clue. I've never heard of anything like this. If it's like the shrine's sacred prohibited space, I'd get it if no one talks about it. <clears throat> or at least I wouldn't be surprised, but... Don't tell me Mew went in there. There's no way a girl would go into a place like this. I don't know. I would. <clears throat> That's where you're wrong. If it's her we're talking about, I guarantee she went inside. <clears throat> I mean, I'm definitely the kind of person that would investigate spooky things like this. Let's go. <laughs> I bet Yusaki ran right in after her, huh? Well, ooh, this and ah, that. <coughs> <coughs> it does seem to fit her M.O. Mew. Come on. What was I just talking about? Uh. Let's track of him. Let's split up to look. Let's don't go alone, Kaito. Uh, let's, let's shout after Kaito and not go alone. <clears throat> Harmony changed. Wait, Kaito, don't go off on your own. I can't just wait around here. <clears throat> well, something happens to Mew. Yeesh, alright, guess we have no choice. Let's go too. I, I don't think I need to translate that. That's easy. Do you hear us? Please answer. Oh, let's go. Oh, see, Dramon. Oh. Oh. Ah, it's it. Ah, there you are. Hmm, what's up? You just ran off, don't worry us like that. Uh, sorry. What the? I don't believe it. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, oh, I know that one too. Uh... I can't remember his name either. It's been so long since I've actually watched this one. Oh my god. <clears throat> Please look at this a mural across the whole wall. This is really something else. Well, you're telling me. I feel like I get swallowed up by it. <clears throat> See, Dramon! Exactly, how do I explain it? There's just something divine about it. Look at him! Nope, that way. That way. Cedramon. Yeah. Maybe it wasn't danger or retribution that caused people to close off this area. They might have been trying to protect this sacred place. <clears throat> hey, now's no time for gawking. Or did you forget what we came here for? 
Sweet. Right, right, right. Oh, sorry. Just got caught up into all this. He's right. We have to, you know, we have better things to do right now. <clears throat> uh, let's go further in. Moral changed. It's kind of small in here. You think there's a passage or something that goes further in? If that's the case, we could be in danger here. <clears throat> I told you to search further in. True that. Best not to go further, or they might need a search party for uh, for our own search party. <clears throat> yeah. Yes, I agree. We should head back to the school for now and. Enough of this heel dragging crap. I'll go it alone if I have to. Huh? I hear footsteps by the entrance. Could it be the others? Oh? Knees? <gasps> Old man! Mm hmm? And you are? Ah, uh, hello there. Who? What's that? Oh, who's that? Your guess is as good as mine. <clears throat> what are all of you doing here? Surely no, you can't be in here. Then why are you in here? Uh, um, well, you see... There's outline, man. What are you doing here? <clears throat> oh, no need to worry. My purpose here is far from nefarious. I'm a researcher of the Kimonogami faith passed down in this region. The shrine is connected to said faith. I just got permission to investigate it. Researcher? <clears throat> investigate? Are you a scholar or some sort? Ah, Indeed. I study ancient Japanese history, researching it for a university nearby. Then, uh, that makes you a professor? Huh? I've been shunned from scientific society. Ah, oh, forget that last part. <laughs> so this place is valuable enough to be worth in researching, huh? Well then, what has brought all of you to a place like this? Yes, well, you see, sir. I'm going to go look somewhere else. Hey, Kaito! Now, now, Shuji, let's just let him do his th own thing for now, yeah? Get why Kaito's feeling restless, but I'm really curious about this place. No idea if Saki and the others came here, but let's look around for some clues. Cool. Clues! Okay. The shrine is pretty weird. Maybe I should talk to the professor or inspect the mural. Okay. Uh, apparently we are just talking to the professor because it is not letting me go anywhere else. Have you all come here to study the kimono gami as well? Yes, we're on a school trip. But we actually came to look for some missing people. Our friends and that guy's sister. Yeah, he came to look for her. And this, the Kimono Gami Shrine? I hope she hasn't been spirited away. Spirited away? Yeah, there's a legend about the Kimono Gami passed down since ancient times. But it's more than a legend. No, the stories are true, you see. True, you say? Indeed, it was once custom to offer up local children to the beast gods' sacrifices. How awful. It was a desperate measure to ensure the harvest, or perhaps to prevent disasters. Yet these children did not die. Supposedly, they were taken somewhere unharmed. <clears throat> so that's what you mean by spirited away? 
Yes, but the custom was lost to the ages, and this angered the ancient Kimonogami. Uh, over time, such deductions were no longer a ritual sacrifice, but a curse or retribution. Many legends regarding such incidents have been passed down in this region. I place no faith in fairy tales. I place no faith in fairy tales, of course. There must be a scientific explanation. <clears throat> oh, so much talking. I just won't get to the Digimon. Let me see the Digimon. Oh. <clears throat> Good story, though. And some reason for the continuous disappearances. Since ancient times, I'm sure of it. I view this as a superstition, or a mental block designed to escape from reality. <coughs> <coughs> my throat is not liking this. <laughs> oh my god. Just a bit longer, at least. He seems pretty worked up somehow. Is he mad or upset, maybe? I know you came looking for your friends, but I'm glad you could see these legendary rooms. Interest in historical origins is a wonderful thing indeed. I support it wholeheartedly. <coughs> Ah, uh, um, thank you, sir. <clears throat> Take a look at this. Who knows, it may end up being of use to you. <clears throat> okay, let's... I want to investigate the walls first. Let's investigate this wall with Cedramon. Oh, oh, and up in the top left, there's a, um, one of the bug Pokemon. Oh, and there's Barkimon up in the top right, the ghost one. <clears throat> so these are all drawings of kimono gami. They come in all shapes and sizes, huh? Hey, why do you think there are there... You think there are there so many... Uh, that's... Uh, um, why do you think there are there so many kimono gami in the first place? That sentence is wrong. <laughs> that is not a proper sentence. <laughs> that can't just be my mind not comprehending that right. <clears throat> Do you have a hunch, sir? Indeed, there are several possible explanations for all this. The unique terrain could explain the frequent uh, incidents, weak footholds, steep slopes, magnetic fields mess with sense of direction, and overgrowth in flora and fauna. Ah, like the red spider lilies then. I believe there's something in the minerals around here that make people lose their way. <clears throat> Creatures of the Kimono Gami faith may have been altered somehow by the substance. I see. That would make sense. <clears throat> okay. No, I don't. No, I don't want to. Uh, wall. The other wall. <clears throat> I don't know which Digimon that could be. Discovery of these minerals has led to rapid development of this region in the recent times. A sudden population boom would naturally increase the number of missing persons. <clears throat> Dwindling resources, depopulation, likely abscorning in the night with such troubles. I suspect the recent landslides are a result of unchecked development since the Showa era. Unraveling the issue piece by piece allows for a logical explanation of the legend. At least that's what I think. Yes, learning from the past can help us in the present. Wow, thank you so much, Professor. What a wonderful and unexpected lesson we've learned here today. Yeah, muchas gracias, Profess. A oh, prof. <clears throat> hey now, show some respect. Interesting. Interesting. No, oh, I don't. No, stop. I. Okay, Professor. Huh. What's with this wall? Is this writing or something? That is writing in the digital. A uh, uh, digital language. I do not know it enough to read it though. <laughs> hmm. Are these drawings or some kind of text? Yeah, something like that. There's all sorts of stuff on this crazy wall painting. I've never seen anything like it. Huh, something's written here. Maybe I can read it? Nope, not a word of it. This is just conjecture based on my investigations, but I think it says Agumon. Agumon! As my research progressed, I learned that each of the Kimono Gami have their own names. 
Is that so? So there must be a bunch of those things running around. <clears throat> Agumon. But why would it say Agumon? I didn't see an Agumon there. Oh? Yikes, what the heck was that? Mew! Where are the others? Oh, stretching. Oh. Make sure it, that you guys are stretching to her when you need to. <clears throat> oh, it's you, Mew. What is it? Did something happen? Some weird creep popped out of nowhere, so I took off. Uh, oh no, I left Saki behind. That voice, Saki? <clears throat> Came from outside near the shrine. Come on, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Whoa, what's with this fog? <clears throat> yeah, man, there wasn't nothing like this when we came through earlier. If we go out in this now, we'll be just as lost as the others. What about it's um, what about Saki and that scream just now? Stay away from me! <laughs> Wait, what the heck was that? Ah, it's little <gasps> rock man. I cannot remember his name. Oh my god. Is, is she being attacked by something? You mean like a pervert? A pervert? On a mountain? Yeah, they exist on mountains too, are we? Come on. She doesn't know perverts don't exist on mountains. That perverts do exist amount. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> Come on. Maybe it's a boar or something. Yeah, I can hear growling, I think. Whoa, hey, I was it just me or did something light up over there? We should head towards her voice. Are my eyes playing tricks on me? I can barely see a thing around here. This fog is seriously weird, man. It bothers me too, but not as much as Saki's screams. Yeah. <clears throat> hey! Saki, Ryo! Are you okay? Wait, something's here. What is that? Some kind of statue? No, no, that thing's moving. <clears throat> what in the world? That's impossible. <laughs> it sounds again. So this weird thing was making it. <laughs> Back off, you freak show! What is that? <clears throat> hey, what's going on? I heard a bunch of screaming back there. You, you were here the whole time? Wait! Kaito, why are you here? Wait, Saki, we're coming to help. Is it you, Aoi? No, stay away. No, come here and help! <laughs> Jeez. <clears throat> the creepy thing's looking this way. What, what, what should we do? It's not like we can just leave them alone, right? Even if she tells us to. This weird statue-like creature set its sights on the others. 
creature? No, a monster. What are you waiting for? Get the hell over here already. <clears throat> could that be one of the kimono gummy? No, how could this be? Professor, he followed us from the shrine. We have to save those guys from this monster. How do you expect to do that? Uh, get closer and talk. Because I'm an idiot. <clears throat> Let's try talking to it. <laughs> yeah, it could just be some kid pulling a prank. <laughs> hey, you there. Whoa, hold on, Shuji. How heavy would a kid have to be to leave footprints that deep? Footprints? <laughs> <laughs> Look out, Shuji! <clears throat> oh! I just got slammed by a rock. <laughs> Takuma! Uh, what the heck? It barely grazed me, and yet what power? <clears throat> you alright? I'm so sorry. You saved me there. This is bad. Let's get out of here. Just run, guys. Run! <laughs> <clears throat> creature we've never seen before is coming right at us. What's going on? What a crazy situation we've gotten into. Why the heck is this happening? <laughs> you okay, Aoi? <laughs> Sounds like a dinosaur. <laughs> oh no, Aoi fell down and that rock monster is coming this way. <laughs> Stop, stay away from her. I can't let it hurt Aoi. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Is he okay? <clears throat> that thing just sent me flying. Oh, jeez. Ow, man, that's kind of, that thing's strong. I'm lucky I got away with a few scratches after a tackle like that. <clears throat> the others, hey, you guys okay? Takuma, are you alright? I'm sorry, this is all my fault. Everyone seems to be okay somehow. The fog has covered the entire area. There's red spider lilies at my feet, so creepy. Oi! Guys, you there? <laughs> oh yeah. Shooting you good? Oh my god, there's so many of them. Oh, jeez. So many rock men. I cannot remember their names! Oh my god, what is their name? <clears throat> when the heck did it corner them? This is bad, it's getting closer and closer. They're in for a world of hurt. Is there any way they can make a break for it? <clears throat> what? Huh? Feeling kind of dizzy. Am I going numb, or did I take a harder hit than I thought? Or is it... <laughs> huh? An earthquake at a time like this? <laughs> Holy crap, the shaking is getting worse. Is everyone okay? Oh my god, that's hurting my eyes, the shaking back and forth. Be careful everyone, move without paying attention and you'll- Wah! Wah! What is it, Shuji? Oh, shaky, shaky, shaky. Whoa! I tried taking a step forward and the ground crumbled underneath me. I plunged into a gaping hole that seemed to pull me in. I couldn't even tell what was happening to everyone else. Unchecked development, the recent landslides, the professor's words are coming back to me. Whoa! Oh. It's so exciting. We're gonna meet our Digimon partners now. Oh. Ooh. 
Let's go, come on. Yeah. Oh, credit. And credit opening. <clears throat> Falcomon. That's a different design to Falcomon than what they've had previously. <clears throat> and Lapramon. I like Lapramon. Also, he doesn't seem like a person to have a lot, Mom, but it's cool. <clears throat> Laura, Mom. Makes sense. Poony, Mom. Very cute. Oh. <clears throat> oh, Drachmon. That's pretty cool. <laughs> it's Yako Mon. Oh, that's so cute! Hey, Professor Man, you get to be in the opening too? <clears throat> He's just like, <laughs> Professor! He doesn't even get a name. He's just, <laughs> Professor. <laughs> doesn't even get a Digimon. He's just, Professor. <clears throat> oh, the kids. Haru and Miyuki. Yay! This is so exciting. So we're finally through the prologue. Oh my god. Finally in the digital world. Let's go. <laughs> Hey, I got an achievement. The adventure begins. Sweet. Ow, am I safe? Am I below the shrine? Looks like I got caught in a landslide or something. Oh, hey, everyone. Is everyone okay? I don't see anyone. Ouch. My head. It's pounding. I can't see anyone. Looks like they aren't here. Maybe I should take a look around. Okay. We'll take a look around. See if we can find anyone. All I can do is look around for now. Okay. Uh, okay, we have deep forest, deep forest, and the overgrown spider lilies. Uh, let's look at the overgrown spider lilies first. The ground's collapsed all around here, but none of my friends are around. I should check out other places. Okay, uh, deep forest one or deep forest two? Uh, so like that. Uh, let's go this one. They're not here. What a relief. That means they weren't caught up in the landslide. I should check out other places. Other deep forests. I don't see anyone here. Maybe I can find some trace of them in a different area. I should check out other places. Well then don't exclamation mark places. <laughs> oh cool. Here we go. I can hear those sounds from before. Is it those stone monsters? Oh no, they're coming this way. I have to get the hell out of here. <clears throat> okay. I don't think they're following me. I made it back to the shrine somehow. No one's here? Not a single person. Is anybody here? Not 
the responses. Where the heck did they... Oh, maybe I can get one of them on the phone. I'll call Minato. No service here? Damn, my phone is useless. What? Did something move just now? <clears throat> oh? Oh man, something's in here. Is it that rock monster again? The sound disappeared. It doesn't look like it's trying to jump me, whatever it is. Uh, carefully move closer. Carefully, we don't know what it is. Could be one of our friends. Not knowing what's coming. This way freaks me out. I'll try moving closer. I'll do my best not to set this thing off. Huh? It's gone? Where in the world? Hey, some of the grass is moving over there. Like something's in there. I can't see anything, but something's there, isn't it? Hmm, this reminds me of the last time. Uh... What did Minato say? About the camera, right? <clears throat> now think about it. I remember Minato saying something back then. Something about picking up weird stuff with his... Hmm. That's right, he picked up a presence with his phone camera. Why don't I take a picture? Right, I'll give it a shot. Okay. Oh! Huh? <gasps> it's a car of mine? <gasps> Whoa, what the heck was that just now? It was just a moment, but I definitely saw something. This will help me see it. So I don't know what I'll do if it's something attacks me again. <clears throat> Nothing will come of just sitting here. I'll look around with my phone, see what I find. Okay. Uh, is he going to investigate? Otherwise, nope. Uh, it was number three, right? Oh, there's some stuff over here. Hello? I want to take a picture of that. <clears throat> Hmm, nothing here, huh? Okay. Uh, what about there? Oh, yeah, I see him. I see him. Hi, little Karaman. What's up, buddy? What What the heck is that? Some kind of creature? Doesn't seem like that rock thing from before. Hope it's a bit friendlier. <gasps> Karaman, wait! Come back! I want to squish your cheeks. Oh, it's gone? Don't tell me it plans to attack from the shadows somewhere. I'll survey other spots with my camera. Okay, uh, I think that way. Is that the only other spot? Oh, there's a spot here. Oh, there he is! What are you doing? I found it. The thing from before. It's right over there, no doubt about it. What should I do? It doesn't look hostile, but still. Oh, he's, he's leaving again. <laughs> Man, did it vanish again? This thing's quick on its feet. At least I think it has feet. It doesn't. <laughs> I'll survey other spots with my camera. Okay. And then I guess the spot. Is there some other spot I can see? Is he coming closer? Oh, oh, there he is. Bingo, there it is. Hey, little buddy! Whoa, it's closer now. Hey, Coromine, you little cutie! <laughs> what is this thing? <laughs> hey, that's my line! Wait, you're... It, it talks? Shoo, back off, dang it! 
I've never seen anything like this before. What the heck is it? Seriously, what's this thing's deal? I'm not a thing. I'm Karamon. I've been waiting for you, old buddy, old pal. Karamon? Sorry, but that pal talk rubs me the wrong way. The name's Takuma, okay? Anyway, just back off for a sec, will you? Takuma? That's your name? Nice to meet you, Takuma. That doesn't answer my question. No, more importantly... What do you mean you were waiting for me? Yeah, for ages, like such a long time, pal. Why? How? Well, that's easy, you see. Uh, um... Hey, why was I waiting? What's with this thing? It understands me, but I wouldn't call this a conversation. Anyway, it doesn't seem to mean me any harm, I think. You took the words right out of my mouth. At any rate, I see you're not human. That's what I am. A human. And a young one at that. A young human? I've never seen one before. You're kind of weird looking, aren't you? Still, I'm glad I got to meet you. Mm-hmm. I've been craving something, you see. I've been waiting forever and ever. Craving? What do you mean? Anyway, you're the one for me. It's like I've been waiting for you forever. What do you mean? I don't get it. Listen up, uh, Koromon, was it? <laughs> so treat me like some kid, alright? I'm already in junior high. What's a junior high? Well, <laughs> well, uh, it basically means I'm an adult. I'm sorry, but this kid from junior high is not an adult. <laughs> oh my god. Stop trying to grow up too fast, bud. <clears throat> huh. Adults are smaller than I figured. <laughs> Uh, anyway, my point is, I'm not a kid. Why not? You seem pretty childish to me. Why else would you get upset over every little thing? Shut up. I've had enough. Back off already. Wait, Takuma. First things first, I've got to shake off this weird critter somehow. I'll try and get away from the train. <sighs> okay, I think I finally lost it. So what the heck was that thing? I've never seen anything like it. But the really weird thing is, I wasn't all that scared of it. I mean, it was so small and it talked like a kid. Plus, it was so buddy buddy. Heck, the fact that it talked at all is weird enough on its own, right? Maybe I was sleepwalking or something? Hmm. 
Maybe I should look around more. What the? Something is moving in the grass. <gasps> it's one of the critters! <gasps> Holy... It's that rock monster that attacked us before. I can't believe one was here. Damn! We can't get away, it's too close. Tip status abnormally. During battle, gaining a status anomaly. Or okay. <laughs> what should I do? Uh, run away. I mean, it's no way you could take it. That thing isn't taking its eyes off me for a second. I can't run like this. Also, uh, may I say that these little sprites are adorable. I like this. <laughs> Still, it doesn't look all that fast. Okay, if I can just bolt. Ah, it jumped at me again. Oh. What the heck, man? Son of a... Looks like it's gonna charge again. Run! <laughs> He's so cute. Squishy. <laughs> Is that Coromon? <laughs> this thing's got an axe to grind with here. Hurry up and get out of here. Oh jeez, my legs are... I'll try and hold it off so you can get away. Here I go! Oh. Boy, you're... Boy, you're... Boy, you're weak. Like, super weak. You're the one that should be running. But I've got to protect you, Takuma. Oh, <laughs> Garamon! Uh, it's no use. Oh man, this is bad. Garamon will be in trouble if this keeps up. I can't believe that tiny little thing's risking its life to protect me. I oh, know I can't just run off on my own and let it fight to the death. But what? Um, protect Karaman. <laughs> I won't let you! Not bad, Takuma. But that might not be the best idea. <laughs> Go, Karaman. At least one of us should escape. <laughs> so I will be the sacrifice. No, I will be the sacrifice. No, I can't just leave you behind, Takuma. <clears throat> Well, I guess that makes two of us then, huh? Oh, now that you mention it. In a, bit of, in a bit of a pinch, but you know what? I can't afford to laugh. What can I say? Suddenly, I feel like I can do it. Yes! I'm gonna go for it, Takuma! It's going Super Saiyan! Um, what are you saying? Just watch, Takuma. I told you I'd protect you and I meant it. Koromo <laughs> Chika! Oh, come on! <laughs> Look at his little stubby tail! <gasps> stubby tails! Look at him! You cute little now. I love him! It's adorable. Yeah! <laughs> He's adorable! Gotsumon! Ah, Godsumon, that's its name. <clears throat> I knew it started with a G. That was about all I could remember. 
<laughs> Spell had its own win condition and loss condition. So, we win if Gotumon is defeated, we lose if Agumon dies. Why isn't it that Gotumon dies, but Agumon dies? Why, why is it not Agumon defeated? <laughs> because he could die, yeah. You can also change the difficulty of a battle. When you fight, you just can't win. You may want to try changing the difficulty. Nah, no, it's fine. I'm gonna I'm a just do my best. It's a crucial battle, so it should uh, uh, so it help to exercise some caution. Defending is an important aspect of battle. End your turn without attacking or using an item to defend. Defending reduces frontal attack damage by half. Attacks from the side and rear are unaffected. Try defending in this situation. Choose end turn. Huh? <clears throat> okay. Defending against the enemy's skill reduces its damage by half. Not only did this significantly lower the damage you took, it also wasted the opponent's SP. Since the enemy attacked this turn, it can't defend. Make the most of this opportunity. Unleash your skill now that the enemy is defenseless. Choose the attack command, then select Pepper Breath from the skill list. Yeah. We can do this. Okay. Attack. Pepper Breath. <laughs> I, I think it's hilarious that it's like pepper breath, but he says baby flame because that's what it is in Japanese. <laughs> During battle, it's important to keep the attack and defense in mind when you take your turns. Okay. Uh, uh, in turn. We don't need to move. We're fine the way we are. Yep, it's fine. Uh, no, we don't need to move. We will attack with a Pepper Breath. Actually, do we need Pepper Breath? Will that kill him? I think that would just kill him. No, we missed! Ah! We missed! Oh no, he came to our side. Okay, um... Attack. Is Pip Breath more accurate? I don't know. No, it is not. But, like, that is, should be enough damage. So let's do it! Thank you! You did great, Agumon. Good job. Good job, buddy. Oh my god. Oh, he lived up! Hey! We have type walk. Hurt move. Move. Just a sec. Okay. <clears throat> okay, we also got potency crystal. Hmm. Incredible. It really beat that monster. And what's with his appearance? This is the same Coromon as before, right? As you explore and earn rewards in battle, you will obtain various items and equipment. Equipable items in particular can improve your abilities and let you use skills. Looks like you found an equipable item. Let's try equipping it now. Press 9 to open the main menu. Okay. Items need to be equipped from the status screen. So open the status menu. This screen shows your team members' abilities and equipment, plus their evolution level. Press C to see more detailed information on a monster. Okay. Use Q and E to change categories. Go to equipment. Okay. Equipment. The ports menu also has several other options, including save, load, settings, and field guide. Be sure to check out all these menus to really get the most out of the game. Okay. Uh, anyway, we want to... Flip that, and we have nothing else. Okay. Training and evolution. Oh, cool. We've got, like, a lot of different, um, evolution branches. Okay. And I am going to go... 
to data. Can I not? Okay. I wanted to save. I guess we can't do that yet. Ooh, I was able to win thanks to you, Takuma. You're a beast out there, Koromon. I thought you were crazy to fight that thing, but then you freaking took it out! Not Koromon, silly. Right now I'm Agumon. Akumon? I thought you said Koromon. Yep, I was Koromon before. Now I'm Agumon. Okay, I really don't get it. But anyway. You really said you really saved my bacon back there. I owe you one. <laughs> that, that goes double for me, Takuma. You got me out of a tight spot back there, and I could only evolve thanks to you. Thanks to me, but I didn't do anything. That's not true. I can't explain it, but when I'm with you, I feel all this power swelling up inside of me. Thanks so much, Takuma. What do you mean? Is that what made you transform? Seriously, what the heck's going on here? Beats me! Right, makes sense. I guess it's my fault for asking you in the first place. <laughs> You're too kind. What about that sounded like kindness? Man, Man everyone's gotta freak out when they see you. Everyone, that's right, I have to go look for them. Everyone, who's that? Oh, I mean all my friends. A weird chain of events brought us to the shrine, see? We all ended up together at one point, but a landslide separated us again. Is that right? They aren't around here. Then maybe they went back to the school already? Well, first things first. I have to make it back to the school building. But I, but I have no idea where I am in these woods. The fog doesn't help, that's for sure. Hey, don't go into the fog, Takuma. Fog, huh? I didn't really notice before, but I think the fog got thicker. I'm not going... I'm not going because I want to, even without it. I'd have trouble figuring out where I am. If we're attacked by that weird thing again, it won't end well for us. I wonder how likely another attack would be anyway. Hard to tell. <coughs> hey, Agumon. About that rock monster thing. Is that a friend of yours or what? First self I've ever seen a thing like that. Is the is this the true nature of the kimono gummy? No it no way. I'd never be friends with someone who just bum rushes you like that. Oh, I didn't mean like a friend friend, just First of all, I'd never attack kids the way they do. All I'm asking is how you guys are connected, that's all. Wait, they? 
Don't tell me there are others out there besides that rock thing. I mean, they could have been using they, as in, like, neither necessarily male or female, or referring to not wanting to gender them. Like, come on, man. <laughs> but yeah, there are, there are lots of them. Yeah, tons and tons. Big ones, tough ones, ones that fly, fast ones, fuzzy ones, you name it. Of course there are good ones and bad ones out there too. Tons, tons and tons you say. I feel a headache coming on. There's tons of things like that out there. This is my first time hearing about this, and definitely my first time seeing it. And there's a bunch of different types too? What's going on? Maybe something happened back at the shrine to the Kimonogami? Like we accidentally broke some sort of seal on the place or something. That could have released those bizarre creatures into the world, right? That reminds me. Mew was talking about some retribution thing back there, wasn't she? No way. I thought that kid just had a weird sense of humor. Still, it doesn't feel weird to be with this talking creature. It's almost as if I've known this little guy for a long, long time. Did the fall do something to my head? Hmm? Hmm? What's wrong, Takuma? <clears throat> well, I was wondering what to do. This place shouldn't be that far from the shrine. I doubt that rock monster went and beat up everyone in our group back there. One of my friends might still be around here. Monster isn't right. That rock mo guy, for example, he's got Simon. Yeah, but. Algumon, the mon in your name is monster. Come on. <laughs> oh, so all of you have names? Got it. Wait, I swear I've heard a story like this before. Oh yeah, the professor mentioned a name back at the mural in the shrine. So these things really are the kimonogami after all. Now let's see, I think we should head back to the school for now. I want to look for my friends along the way. Would you mind helping me, Agumo? Yeah, I'm with you, Takuma. Alright, let's go. <laughs> just keeps going. I just want to find a point to stop because I'm tired and stuff is happening. The lambs are being born. I must take pictures. Was that a scream I just heard? Yeah, it sounds like a human. I heard it coming from over there. That voice, I swear it sounds like Minoru. Over by the shrine. Okay, let's go. Yeah! Okay, can we... Can we save? I reflexively started running when I heard Minoru cry out. At that point, I hadn't given much thought to the situation I'd found myself in. About the mysterious creature, Agumon, or the place I'd wandered into. Who knew things would turn out like this? An adventure with our lives on the line. I couldn't have imagined it back then, if I'd tried. Part one, okay. Oh! Damn. Okay. Can we save now? Can we can we save now? I just can can we save now? <sighs> we can save now. Okay. Yes, we are saving here. And we're gonna continue this next time. Oh my god. Oh this is gonna be so much reading! <laughs> Which I don't mind, it's just reading out loud because we don't have, um, 
the voices in English. So I want to just help you guys out in case you just want to mostly be listening in the background and stuff. Hmm. Oh, I need so much water. Um, anyway, uh, I have to go <laughs> and do some stuff. Um, but we're going to pick this up. Um, I won't be able to do it tomorrow because we're shopping tomorrow and that takes up my day. But the day after, hopefully I'm not too tired and we can keep playing this because I'm really excited about this game. I love Digimon and I just I just want to get into it. I want to I want to play as much as I can. Um, so I'll be back next time, maybe a couple days, and we can continue playing this. Uh, if if you want, uh, I upload these to my YouTube channel. I'll figure out a thumbnail and stuff later upload it and you can go watch it again watch future ones in case you miss out on them if you're also interested in the gameplay and the story and Digimon in general um I also have other videos up there as well but um I gotta go so look after yourselves because you're important and I'll see you next time Bye.